Uploading videos with Microsoft Stream is easy, and anyone can do it. You can find the upload button on the top of any page or just drag and drop new videos to one of your groups or channels. Select video files from your local computer or device. While your file is uploading, you can fill out the title and description for your video. This is the metadata that will make your video easier to find. Type in the time codes of interesting points in the video to make a simple table of contents. Use hashtags to group related videos together. Your viewers can click on the hashtags in the description to see other videos and click on the time codes you entered to jump to that point in the video, giving them an easy way to get to the parts of the video they want to watch. Next, select the language that is being spoken in the video. This enables an automatically generated closed caption file for supported languages. You can also upload your own. In addition, people with the correct license will be able to discover your video based on the text in the transcript. When you see sample frames from the video, choose one to be the thumbnail for your video, or upload your own custom image. In the permissions section, you can control who can see your video, who can own and edit it, and which groups and channels it's displayed in. If this box is checked, it means that everyone in your organization can see the video and is able to add it to their groups and channels. Use the Share With drop-down to narrow your search scope and pick who you want to share your video with. Use the My Group search scope to add your video to a group that you can contribute to. The channel's search scope is used to add your video to a channel directly, including company-wide channels. Use the People search scope when you want to grant permission to individual people. Any person or group added will automatically be granted view permission to your video. If you want any of these viewers to also be able to update your video, check the box next to their entry in the Owner column to upgrade their permission. In the Options section, you can control if comments are on or off for the video. You can also manage caption and subtitle files. Once your video is done uploading, choose Publish Now to make the video available for viewing as soon as it's done processing. Once the video is processed, you can view your video on the player page. Happy uploading!